on the set, main set for my other channel, Adele Celeste, which is just my fun life and interesting things, comedy. So if you can take me as a tough, controversial figure, yeah, right, am I tough? <laughs> then you can, if you enjoy me here, then you can go over to my main channel, Adele Celeste, and watch my funny shows. Okay, so we are going to talk about President Trump today. And I'm a Trump supporter, as you can see. I'm a Trump voter, and I have a lot of people in my family that vote for Trump. Okay, and ever since the election, I have been writing him, sending him cards, like one every month, to encourage him because we know how negative the media is, and we need, I mean, President Trump is really, really strong, and it's amazing. We've watched so many politicians cave and give in to pressure of like, no, 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 don't do that. So I've been writing him like every month. And it was fun, after Christmas, New Year's, I got something from the White House. I suppose that everybody who writes the president, no matter what president it is, will get something from them after Christmas and the New Year. But anyway, so I got this. It's from the White House. And it has a nice thank you. It's a form letter. If you can read it, probably not. I will, and I got a nice picture. You know, like an autographed picture of them in the office. And I hope it's clear. So, I was tickled. I was tickled and pleased to get this. And it's a very nice custom to send a pre person who's been sending you cards and letters a thank you and an autographed picture. And it says, Dear Adele, thank you for your kind message and prayers. The unwavering faith of the American people has sustained our country through the best and worst of times. As we look ahead as one nation, we will fulfill our sacred duty and deliver upon the promise of America for all, for, for all of our people. We will strengthen our national spirit and ensure that America continues to shine as a beacon of freedom for all the world to see. Melania and I are heartened by your support. Thank you for taking the time to share your thoughts and for keeping us in your prayers. God bless America. So, I was excited, and I'm going to keep on writing him letters every month for the duration of his um, time in office. It's important to keep him encouraged. Very important. So, to share that with you and say that this is June. The president's birthday is coming, June 14th. Don't forget to send him a birthday card. I've got him a birthday card. Very beautiful and bright. That's like the kind I love. I think it's beautiful. I'm going to send this to President Trump, but I had to make this video and show you what I was sending him before I sent it and remind you to send him. I'll include the address to the White House in the description box, okay? It says, Believe You Can Fly. Um, let your birthday be a day when your wishes catch the wind, your spirit soars freely, and all your cares just float away. Happy birthday. And we know any president has a really rough time with all the responsibility and all the criticism. So, this is a beautiful card, glitter on the balloons, bright the colors, it's just dreamy. So, this is the card I'm sending to President Trump for his birthday. So, don't forget, his birthday is June 14th. Send him a letter of congratulations and thank him for all the great work he's been doing. God bless, and let freedom ring.